I believe everyone has a dream, a God-given passion to do something great with their lives that affects the world for good. Some people call it a divine purpose. I love how Frederick Buechner described it, the place where your deepest joy meets the world's greatest need. For me, the passion is seeing people from all walks of life experience and encounter the crazy, life-changing love of God through music. Part of that dream is writing and recording songs, and I'm getting excited because this fall, I have an opportunity to record a brand new worship project filled with songs I've been working at for the last two years. I'd love for you to partner with me to help make this dream a reality. I'll never forget the time when I experienced God's presence through a song. I was sitting in my brother's room, he had a keyboard set up. I didn't even know how to play the keyboard, but I just began following Jesus. No one was in there. I, I sat at the keyboard. I just began to find keys that work together and began to form chords. And, and I began to, to sing about God's mercy. After a few moments, I, I sensed what I can only explain as like a wind kind of blowing through the room and God's presence crashing over me like an ocean. Wave after wave of his love, his forgiveness, after a while, it's just a mess at the keyboard. I couldn't even make out any words, so I was just singing and sobs, and it took me over. Worship encounters like that have healed me, have given me purpose and meaning, have inspired me to live for God, to respond with my whole life as an act of worship to Him. Since that time, I've had the incredible privilege of creating sacred spaces where people can encounter God through music, find healing, experience God's love, and be inspired to be on mission for Him. Two years ago, I recorded Radiant, a worship project for the church, sailed to number five on iTunes. Now I've got 30 brand new songs, and I feel like it's time to share those songs with you and with the world. Pursuing a dream can be scary, and this project is definitely bringing up a lot of my fears and insecurities. Amidst the fear, I cling to this conversation I had with my wife, Danielle. I'll never forget it. We were sitting at a little cafe and began sharing with her that I wanted to do this. And she said, the only thing more scary than pursuing a dream is not doing anything at all and then living with the regret of not having tried. For me, this project represents confronting my deepest fears and learning to trust God just a little bit more. For this project, I have the unique opportunity of working with Grammy-nominated songwriter and Dove Award-winning producer of the year, Jason Ingram, and nationally acclaimed producer, Paul Mabry. The project is gonna cost $35,000, which may seem like a lot of money to you, but it's actually a great deal. Projects like this one can cost from $75,000 up. My family and I have already raised some of the funds for this project, but we need your help to make up the rest. For the next 30 days, I wanna ask you to partner with me through an online funding platform called Kickstarter to raise $25,000. Your contributions are gonna to go toward producers, engineers, studio time, and making the physical product. Anything beyond the $25,000 will go toward promoting this new project and future worship projects down the road. My heart is overwhelmed when I think of people living without the knowledge and experience of God's love. I hope through this album, people are able to encounter God in such a way that God's spirit like the wind just blows through them. My hope is that believers would just be inspired, would be reminded of who God is and inspired to live for Him and the things that matter. That's the dream. Let's make this dream a reality.